Hello Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope you're all having an amazing day today. I'm going to be taking a look and seeing what's manifesting for you all. What's going on right now in your current situation with you, the person on your mind, if any, and what you need to know. So whenever you do see this, it will be the right time. As always, take what resonates and leave out the rest. Practice using your own discernment. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I am spiritually goldie on all platforms. And if you're interested in a personal reading done by myself i will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all okay four of pentacles and three of cups reversed interesting somebody has been like not able to let go of a third party situation or a love triangle Feels like someone has been holding certain feelings to themselves in regards to this. And it's caused triggers. Okay, some of you have been feeling like you're going crazy is what I'm hearing. Like, are you, you're wondering if you are, if what you believe is, is true or if it's, if it's not. You're like, I feel like I'm going crazy right now. Or someone is like triggering some something that is just like not even in your character okay and you're making a decision to go ahead with certain plans you're taking action towards something here okay okay you're making actions towards Taking, taking control over a situation, taking control over your life, um, moving forward with something that is pulling on your heartstrings, okay? We have the Ace of Cups around you, so it's showing that there's, there's love around you. Tell me about this Ace of Cups. Okay, this could be in the workplace um, or someone who you like went to school with, someone who you who has like seen you grow up in some way. Okay, I'm seeing with the Six of Cups, we do have some someone from the past coming around. Um, ex, we do have an ex lover. It could be an ex lover, or it could just be someone who you've like grown up with in childhood, went to school with, or they've seen you grow up in some way. Okay, but I do see you have a lot of strong emotions right now, and you're taking control over these strong emotions that you're feeling. Okay, feeling all the feelings that you're feeling, and not avoiding it, not suppressing it, okay? Because I feel like you've done that in the past where you have held on to certain feelings, you've um, let it build up and then at, and then to a point where you maybe explode. But at this point, you're like really allowing yourself to feel things. And I think that's really important when you can allow yourself to truly give yourself space and tap into how are you truly feeling right now? And just being with those feelings, that's what this King of Cups is all about. It's being aware of your feelings. Being aware of um, the things that maybe you're still healing from. The things that you um, are hoping for. Just being with it. And taking action towards, at some point building some sort of control over these feelings and not allowing them to erupt because I'm pretty much seeing like a volcano. Okay. Two of pentacles, two of wands. Someone is going back and forth here on a decision. 
what is this decision about? You and another person are both wanting to make plans together, wanting to make decisions towards something long term. Okay. And I feel like you're kind of going back and forth on whether or not you're able to prioritize this right now, whether or not you're able to open up your heart to this and make space for this emotionally right now. I'm seeing someone making plans to come see you, to travel towards you. Okay, someone wants to make actions here. It looks like there's 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 um this person who is not letting their pride stop them from going after what they want at this point. Some of you have Leo in your chart. You have Leo in your chart. Um, I do feel like you're about to gain clarity pretty soon or get some answers pretty soon from a, from a situation that you felt very confused about. Okay, I'm seeing Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. You have a soul contract with this person. Okay. Now, I'm getting this feeling of someone misses you. Someone misses you. Someone thinks about you. They're missing you right now. And there's this energy of them feeling like they want to see you again. They want to reconcile things, have a reconciliation or forgiveness, even if it doesn't mean a reconciliation. Clarify the Six of Cups. Four of Wands reversed, yeah. So, yeah, somebody is contemplating on and waiting for the right time to to say something, to communicate. They have a desire to do that. They're desiring to talk to you, um, to ask for forgiveness, even if it doesn't mean a reconciliation. But they miss being by your side or they miss um, what was. They miss um, a relationship that they had with you. Okay, interesting. So they see you feeling like this is just like a disaster waiting to happen. Or they feel like you're not going to be expecting um, communication or a return from them. They're seeing you as like going through a moment in your life where it does feel like things are being put in uh into the right place but for but there's like this discomfort discomfort of change wow you have a uh, the ace of pentacles so you have some sort of reward coming in something is like being made right in your life now even if it doesn't feel like it in the moment and someone as you're going through this this person is like really seeing you as a golden opportunity, a new beginning that they feel like is worth fighting for, is worth um, not giving up on. They, they're coming towards you to uh, validate something that you've been feeling here. Clarify this, Six of Wands. It feels like they, yeah, King of Wands. So it, this person wants to make you an offer. They want to win you over they feel like it's gonna be hard but they're trying really they're they're like i'm gonna try really really hard but the thing is though it feels like this person coming back around is just only going to create another attachment or like a trauma bond with this person okay it does look like there's gonna be a lot that is gonna be said here a lot coming in all at once, a lot coming in suddenly, very soon, very quickly. Yeah, seven of cups. Someone's coming in with a big, 
with a big urge to uh, fight for this. But I'm seeing just like... I'm hearing jealousy. Jealousy issues coming coming around again. It just feels like a, uh, a, a cycle repeating itself. With this person. There's an offer coming in. But it's some sort of small offer. Again, I was picking up the lines like uh, forgiveness, even if it doesn't mean reconciliation. They're asking you to use your discernment to step into this King of Swords energies to um, look at things more logically. Okay. It's time to make a logical decision on this situation more than an emotional decision right now. Sometimes we need to use um, the facts. We need to uh, look at things from a standpoint of reality rather than the potential, rather than what we want it to be. Um, and, and really thinking about what's the, what's the best case scenario, what's the best outcome for yourself. Um, Divine Feminine, this is looking at yourself or stepping into this Divine Feminine energy. Or if you're a man, you could be dealing with um, a feminine energy here. Okay, roll the dice. Proposal. Ooh, you're manifesting. You're manifesting. With this roll of dice, I'm feeling like something lucky. You know, you're manifesting some luck coming your way. An offer, a proposal coming your way here. And this person would only just slow you down or keep you back, hold you back, keep you attached. It's like they're coming around to see if you're still um, attached to them, to see if you've still moved on from them. And this is this is this is just um, a warning because you are manifesting something really good, good luck. And I think that's the direction you'd want to be headed in. I'm seeing the numbers four, six, eight. Those numbers, they could be related to birthdays, special days, synchronicities. I'm seeing the letters T, G, S, C, E, L, A, F, D, T. Those letters could be in your name or someone else's name. But with that said, this is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know. If you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have an amazing and blessed rest of your day. Bye.